Hyundai has come on strong in the last 10 years, and Sonata, its best-selling model, has done heavy lifting for the brand. I'm Tom Volk with Driven for the New York Times. The seventh generation gets Hyundai's new Fluidic Sculpture 2 design language, which is less fluid and sculpted than the sixth generation. It is a bit surprising that Hyundai sobered up the shape. It could be argued that the outgoing model helped set the current trend of dramatic design in this segment. If you really like the old swoopy sedan, you can still get it through 2015, but only with the hybrid powertrain. Hyundai went for a sophisticated premium image this time. I'd call it conservative. The structure is stronger. A 41% improvement in body rigidity helps driving dynamics and safety. There's more sound insulation, too. For all you traveling salespeople out there, Sonata approaches Buick and Lexus in its quietness, so much so that at highway speeds, you're going to hear a little bit of air rushing past the windshield pillars. Three engines are available, all of them four cylinders. The only one without a turbo is this 2.4 liter. It makes 185 horsepower and 178 pound-feet of torque. A six-speed does the gear changes here. Transmission dynamics, throttle response, and steering weight can be tuned, always defaulting to normal on startup. This is a sport model. That sport must be croquet. Zero to 60 is a leisurely 10 seconds or so. Both it and the two liter turbo make less power now. Sonata is not the muscle car in class. The suspension is improved. Large bumps are soaked up nicely with a good dollop of control to go with the comfort. You can dial in a nice heft to the adjustable power steering and there's a lot more information coming through the steering wheel. I just don't know that I'd call the experience sporty. The Sport Turbo might be more engaging with a different steering rack, paddle shifters, and a flat bottom steering wheel. Fuel economy is up slightly. The EPA rating is 25 city, 37 highway. The Eco model squeezes out a few extra miles per gallon. The cabin gets an updated appearance with crisp lines and soft materials. Part of me prefers cloth seats. They grip and breathe better than leather. These are heated. Available safety tech includes blind spot warning, cross path detection, and lane change assist. Apple's CarPlay interface will be available in late 2014. Siri Eyes Free is available now. It allows you to do tasks on your iPhone using just voice commands. Schedule lunch tomorrow at 12.30 p.m. with Melissa Clark. You have an event about lunch with Jimmy Fallon that overlaps with this. Hyundai's Blue Link lets you operate the door locks and lights, plus start the engine from anywhere using a smartphone app. If you're off in the driver, the carpool gang will really like it back here. It's pretty roomy. It has the same kind of space found in Accord, Impala, and Passat. Higher trim levels get creature comforts such as extra air vents, heated seats, and a panoramic roof that's impressive while sitting back here. Here's a feature I really like. If you've got your hands full and the transponder key in your pocket, just simply stand close to the trunk for three seconds and it opens automatically. Brilliant. Yes, the seat backs do split and fold, handy if you're not buying a crossover, and the trunk is pretty spacious. Very few sedans can score an eight in the TP trunk test. 2015 Sonatas start at just under $22,000. The Sport here begins at twenty-four dollars This one is $27,600. That's a reasonable price for a roomy, quiet, and comfortable sedan. Just don't expect a lot of thrills from the throttle or design. Okay, the 2015 Sonata is hardly a bad-looking car. The crisp lines are nicely balanced and all, and the cohesiveness flows from the outside, note the trapezoidal grille, to the trapezoidal center stack. It's just not as emotional as the last generation. Something to remember, Camry has been the 500-pound gorilla in this segment forever, and it's never been edgy. But here's the other thing, Toyota knows this and is just now shipping the new Svelte design. Oh, well, for Toyota anyways. Well, gang, that is my opinion of the 2015 Hyundai Sonata. Now, considering the strong family resemblance to the Genesis, I really have to wonder what the next generation Elantra is going to look like. I have to believe they're going to tone that one way down. It's pretty swoopy. Uh, we'll see. 
That's Driven. I'm Tom Volk.